Let me read you then what you have said about sure. what you have done. Sure. You have said, my job was to meet a girl, go on a few dates, sleep with her, get her to fall in love with me to the point where she'd do anything I say and then get her on webcam so we, we could become rich together. I don't think that's what I personally said. I think that's, that's exactly what no, you said. That's, on your that's a, that's, no, I've never said that. That's something that you found on the internet. Doesn't mean I've said it. And, and, and again, once again, if any female on the planet has a problem with me, I strongly recommend her to go to the police and try and pursue me for criminal charges. It's actually very interesting that me, one of the most famous people in the world, who's been vilified by the legacy media and places all over the internet, while everyone has attacked me from every single angle, while federal agencies from multiple countries have called over 2,000 women who know me, we stand here with zero new accusations since my arrest. Zero. If you took any famous person, any man of substantial wealth, and you called 2,000 women who knew him, he'd find an ex-girlfriend is upset, somebody who wants money who's upset. They called 2,000 people who knew me and could not find a single woman to make a new complaint. The, the, only com the only complaints they have against me are the initial complaints, which we can prove are lies, and that's where it stands. So I do, I'm, I'm not going to sit here and allow you to pretend that I'm some kind of evil predator. When actually, I'd argue the fact, I'd argue the fact that people who've been investigated to the level I've been investigated to, if you were to take the average man on the street and investigate his entire life for 14 months, call everyone who's ever known him, and vilify him in the media, and encourage people to come forward for money, and you try to contact every ex-girlfriend he's ever had. You would, would come forward and accuse those people of rape and accuse those I people I think that you would have a lot more, I think you would have a lot more flack than I've got. I'm actually such a nice person that the I've BBC never had anyone come spoken to somebody since your arrest who says exactly those things, that with you it's all manipulation, there's an ulterior... Is this Sophie? Everything Is this Sophie? Done. Oh, Sophie, the, the, the fake name, no face. No, I was the, so the story that was wanting invented. to please him and wanting him to be happy that I was just kind of, yeah, okay, do whatever you want. And what is she accu has she accused me of a crime, this imaginary Sophie? She's making the point that there is has she accused me of a crime? emotional or psychological manipulation. I've asked you a question and I've allowed you into my house. I'm asking you a question. Correct, but you're not the boss here because I've allowed you into my house. I'm asking you the question. Correctly, and I'm telling you. You get to decide the answers. No, we're equal here. I've allowed you into my house. You don't come here with a position of authority. I'm doing you the favor as legacy media, giving you relevance by speaking to you, and I'm telling you now, this Sophie, which the BBC has invented, which is no face of, nobody knows who she is. The and BBC did not invent Of her. course not, and she, because you never invent anything. And she has not filed, she's not filed criminal charges against me. What are we talking about here? What We're is she talking saying? talking about emotional manipulation has she, the sex industry for your financial gain. Absolute garbage. She has not filed criminal, this person, if they exist, has not filed criminal charges against me. I welcome anybody who believes I've harmed them, male or female, any point in the past to file criminal charges against me, I'll fight them. I know who I am, I know what I've done, and I know the truth, and I know that I'll be found innocent of this attack. The reason I'm being attacked is because of my massive influence, not because I've ever hurt anybody. And for you to sit here and say that everybody around you is saying you're innocent, but that doesn't matter because the state will say they're victims, and they're just going to grab everybody you know and call everybody victims, even if they say they're not, and try and put you in jail. You are describing a matrix attack. You're not describing human trafficking. I'm describing women who are going to court to accuse you of rape and human trafficking. We will see what women go. We will see what women go to court at the end of this trial. Please? We'll see which women go. Can to I court. finish, please? We'll see which women go to court. I'm describing women who are going to court to accuse you of rape and human Sophie trafficking. Sophie hasn't gone to court. Sophie doesn't exist. I'm describing women who have spoken to the BBC at length. Sophie doesn't exist. And other media ex organisations about what they say is emotional manipulation and coercion. And I'm quoting back to you your own words. Where you describe they're not my words. coercion. They're words, you found, they're words you found on the internet, and Sophie doesn't exist.